Well, hello everyone. Welcome back to Treptov Gaming here on YouTube. We are in the game Grounded, and this is now episode three. Well, it's it's reasonably early in the morning, <coughs> and I'm off to do quests. So, top left-hand corner, it says unblock the obstructed laser. So, apparently, the sneezy guy that needs a tissue all the time. This wasn't the guy that I heard, but he'll do. Give myself another little bit of food. I'm heading over this way, because over near the, you know, mysterious machine, there is the three lasers, and one of them's blocked. So, we need to solve that issue. So let's have a look. So don't forget, we hit the target button, and it did a few things, which is great. Um, I was thinking it had something to do with this guy here, but it's not until I realized that uh, the laser's not going to hit this thing here if it's obstructed by grass. So I'm gathering I just need to cut this down. So we're over here. Let's cut this puppy down. Ta da! Oh. So that's all it was. Investigate the machine further. Okay. So now we have the activate button. So I guess we need to go ahead and activate. Okay, it's zooming out. Oh, well, looks like it's working. Oh. something that sounded like a big far off explosion? Yeah, in that direction. Well, I tell you what, it couldn't work, could it? I mean, it couldn't make you big, because that'd be the shortest game in history. So, uh, investigate the oak tree explosion. So we're going to have to go in this direction. Uh, are we ready? Not really. Are we going to go that direction? Yes. Because we kind of have no choice. Um, it is 10.42 in the morning, so I gather we better get a bit of a go on. Get aphid. There is actually a drink container bottle over here. Has it got some liquid in it that I can grab? Oh, hang on. Yes, it is. I'll slurp that up. Fantastic. There's another one here too, actually. Okay, it's dropping out and come. Okay, yep, cool. Where's the oak tree again? Over that way. All right, let's go over to the oak tree. Hello, ants. No, there's too many of you together, so I'm not doing anything. Like he says sometimes, don't want any trouble. Uh, or whatever he says. Oh, we have a root to jump on. Looks a bit like a snake in one way, doesn't it? Uh, what's moving over there? Let's can we, see what's around here. Can we peek this? A new one. Oh, here's a spider or oh, weaver. Eh, uh, maybe not. Some ants there. As long as we don't go over that way, I guess. Old Ant Hill. That's what I discovered. I'll stay away from that area. What do we got up here? Hmm. Oh. These are the acorns. Smacking the acorns. Ooh. I got more stuff. Cool. There's another one. Even more stuff. That's where the explosion seems to be. What have you got over here? Don't like the look of that. What is under there? I don't know what's under there, but let's stick 
to the fringes for the time being. Nothing about to fall down on top of me. I don't think. Oh, that one I've already had. That was the explosion from the previous one. Picking up some sap though. Uh, even more acorns. Cool. I know I needed the acorns before. So we're just picking up stuff as we go. I'm a bit wary, but I don't see any movement in the bushes. I don't hear anything. Let's keep investigating. Okay, cool. Another one. Hmm. A sap clump. Well, I'll have you as well. Wow, that takes a bit of a hit. Look at all that sap. Holy dooly, that's worth it. Hang on, what have I got there? Oh, acorn bits. So I've got at least three things I can investigate. Whoop, more the Jew. I feel a little bit nervous. So I'm not sure what I'm about to find. What I'm thinking of is that there's no nothing about to kill me. Okay. Hmm, more sap. This is pretty cool. There you go. How's that? That's not bad for the amount of sap. Man, it's awesome. Okay. Like it's kind of around that way. There's more of those things crawling through the ground. Well, flavored drink. There's another drink bottle. There's another one down there. Oh, this is the pond. Okay. Yeah. This is the pond area. Alrighty. Let's see. Hey, more icons. Holy dilly, there's a lot of acorns around here. Wow. I'm going back with a lot of stuff. Or maybe I should build a base around here. This looks like a pretty good place to build a base. I mean, that seems to be a reasonable distance to run. Okay, how do we get in here? We just drop down. We kind of can. What's up here? Is that a spider? No, that looks like leftovers from the explosion. So this is a door. This must be the lab. Oh crap. Crap sake, what was that? Did you hear that? Oh, it's the spider. Holy dooly! What the You go without saying, but that is a big spider. You got that right. Can I hit him from here? Oh, I can't. Hang on, hang on. I'm saving this. <laughs> oh, man. Are you kidding me? Can I save it? Hang on. Save. Why can't I save it? Oh, because I'm in combat. You punk boy. He's angry spider. 
safer in here. <laughs> you can, it'll go away. This mm. place is getting pinker by the minute. Hey, there's an analyzer over here, though. Weird. Oh, look, I understand all that. The science and the what and covalent space reduction. Oh, yeah, it'll make sense. And can it be cooked? Absolutely. It's contained and cool. Quarks. Yeah, all that kind of stuff. Here we go. Look, I've got one. Which one am I doing? Which one am I doing? Do this one first. What's it going to tell me? Holy dooly. So, acorn, chest plate, face mask, leg plates. Oh, <gasps> storage chest. Hey, a grinder. Water container? Yeah, that one was worth it. That was pretty cool. <laughs> pretty happy with that one. How about the lid? What's the lid tell me? Ooh, sap catcher, smoothie station, spinning wheel. A garden. You can make your own gardens. Cool. This is getting interesting. Woohoo! What else can we do? We'll analyze these little acorn bits. What's that do for you? Oh, I can make a boost juice. Cool. Well, that's alright. Don't mind. I don't mind at all. It's unpowered. Oh, okay. Resource surveyor. Can I open these things? No. None of these things work. Can I get through here? This looks all... Oh, I can. Cool. Hey, look, there's a camera. Of what? What's that? The black ant hill. <laughs> that was even more sap. How much sap can I put in? <laughs> can I fit all this in? I hope I'm not stealing it. I think I am. Gee, look at that. That's an old monitor. Battery backup failure. Pond. Haze. Are these cameras at different labs? Don't know. It's a bit messy around here, by the way. It's a little bit messy. Help Burgle stand. Oh, is this Burgle? <gasps> I got you! Burgle, dude! He's a cute little robot. Holy dooly, he sounds like Thanks the... For the helping hand. He sounds like the robot out I of Borderlands. <laughs> Burgle, acting science manager for this project. I am also a robot. No kidding! I am sure this all must be very disorienting for you, but hopefully I can explain. Okay, go ahead. I am sure this all must be very disorienting for you, but hopefully I can explain. Okay, go ahead and explain. I suspect you were miniaturized by Dr. Tully's spacer uh, device. No kidding. Why are you here in the yard? I do not know. In fact, I cannot seem to recall much of anything. Oh. Okay. A recent power surge has caused a massive raw science containment explosion. This lab, as you can see, is a disaster. Yeah, you can see that. And what's worse, the explosion has disrupted my computing power. My memory banks are corrupted. Fantastic. Sorry to pile on the bad news, my new friend. How can I be of service? Where exactly am you I? You are here, in the Oak Lab. Built and used by Dr. Wendell Tatelli to experiment on all things small. Okay. This is the base of operations for conducting experiments in his yard. Uh, who is this guy? Dr. Tully is a brilliant scientist and inventor. Right. He is also my creator. Okay. My initial protocol was to serve as the short order cook of the future. You're a cooking guy? However, I have been recently promoted to acting science manager to assist with his experiments. No doubt my previous work experience has been invaluable to Dr. Tully. <laughs> really? Although, now that I am processing it, I have not seen him for several weeks. Mm, okay. And now I cannot recall where he went. It must be my corrupted memory banks. So how come I can't remember anything? It seems you and I are both a little discombobulated. <laughs> 
discombobulated? Given my best calculations, your biomass has been subject to covalent spacing reduction via interatomic energy extraction. Mm, okay. In other words, you have been shrunk. Oh, fair enough. It is likely this was achieved using Dr. Wendell Tully's spacer platform. Spacer. Patent pending. <laughs> Patent pending. Tricking can be a traumatic experience for tiny human brains, and memory loss is a known side effect. Okay. Hopefully your memory will return in time. Hopefully. How do I get home? To return to your prior size, you would need to successfully activate Dr. Tully's spacer platform. Okay, well let's do that then. Unfortunately, my readings indicate it is inoperable. Yeah, crap. It appears to have suffered several malfunctions from the explosion. Right. I am sorry, but it appears you may be stranded here for some time until we find a solution. So hang on, can we fix the spacer? Ha <laughs> ha! That is a great idea. Oh, Let me run a full diagnostic scan on it and see what we need to do to get it fixed Okay, up. that should be easy then. Processing! Processing! Right, right. Memory fault. Ah, sheesh. b 3000 Ominent OS script runtime error. Great, it's probably built on Windows, right? Arg! I am sorry again. It appears I have sustained more damage to my memory chips than expected. Fantastic. Without those memories, I do not know how to repair the spacer. So Ham, we need to get these memory chips then. Dr. Tully used two types of chips to back up my memory. Right, what are the two chips? Auxiliary chips are small capacity chips used to store project data. If you find these, I should be able to help you learn new survival recipes. Okay, so we've got to get auxiliary chips, the smaller ones. Super chips are special, and they are gold! They back up full directories of my memory system. Okay, so auxiliary chips are the small ones, super chips are the big ones. If we ones. are going to fix the spacer, that yeah. data is bound to be on a super chip. Well, then I should go get the super chip. I suggest exploring the other labs in the backyard. Return with any memory chips you find. Uh, there are other labs? Dr. Tully has built many more labs throughout the yard. Right. Each lab is used for various experimental procedures. I can upload their locations to your scabby. Stand by. Cool. Processing. Processing. Uh -oh. Doesn't sound good. Error. <laughs> Files not found. Code Blue screen of death. C four zero four. Cheese and fries. The lab locations are missing from my memory banks too. Gee, no kidding. But we are in luck. Oh. I was able to retrieve the location of one of the facilities, the Hedge Lab. Well, what's the Hedge the Lab? The Hedge Lab is the observation center of the yard and used for research on arachnid webbing. Oh, uh, doesn't sound good. <laughs> you will find the hedge near the house if you head southeast. The lab is located deep inside the hedge, sending the coordinates to your scabby. Okay, send it to my scabby. Try to find the hedge lab first, but there is nothing stopping you from searching the yard for the other labs. Except, of course, thousands of angry, hungry insects. <laughs> <laughs> Very funny. That reminds me. Dr. Tully locks the important labs with biometric scanners. You will need access for any chance of success. Well, that would be good. Head over to the ASL terminal and place your hand on the biometric scanner near it. Give it a moment to sync your signature into the mainframe. How long's a moment? Once you are registered, you will be granted access to the ASL network of computers too. Okay, all right. ASL grants access to daily work items, nay, tasks, nay, quests. Yes, ah, quests. quests. Okay. I will reward you raw science for each completed quest. Raw science, okay. In my cool. science shop, what up, you can trade raw science back for survival recipes from experiments that Wendell conducted when he was first exploring the yard. Oh, okay. Log on to the like ASL shop. terminal over there and see what is available. Unless you have any other questions, you really should get started finding those ch chips. Okay. And try not to die out there. Yeah, okay, thanks for that advice. <laughs> have an exponentially great day! Fantastic, Burgle! You're so helpful. Where's the ASL terminal? That away? Look out, big boy! Hey, look at this! What's this? Science is surprisingly oh. awesome. Wow, that was 500 raw science. Okay, if I see them, I'll just run through them then. Oh, this is the biometric scanner. Hold, hold to use. I'm holding! And I'm holding! 
and I'm holding. Purchase an upgrade in the sh science shop using the ASL terminal. Uh, this thing. The ASL terminal. The, uh, what? This is a science shop. Oh, okay, so you... Oh, okay, this is how much it costs. This is what you can buy. Okay. Cooking... Multi-story bases. Wow. A smithing station. Hey, look. Hang on, is that... That's what I've got. 1940 RS. Well, that'd be a no-brainer. It's only a hundred. Smithing station. Workstation used to upgrade weapons using various materials. I do it your way when you can do it I bought that. Put your cares away and have an exponential Cooking. Day. Cooking things. Multi-story bases. Oh, hang on a second. That's what I'm after. The grass floor. Solid floor computers. Yeah, that's what I'm after. Oh, hang on. Hang on, does he... So, if you buy the thousand raw science, it gives you all this. Well, it allows you to... This is like the blueprints for it, I guess. Uh, okay, I'm doing the multi-story bases. Thanks for the class. Fantastic. <laughs> Okay, I need to do some more stuff to get some more of my raw science up, but that is good. What's this one? Um, Hunter, kill... Oh, I already tried, started to kill gnats. That's worth 60, that can't be too hard. I craft a clover... Cl clover. Craft a clover hood. Well, that's a bargain. Craft a gas mask. Uh, well, definitely that one. Oh, can I take all these? Kill the gnat. Shouldn't be that hard to make a gas mask. I'll just take all those then. Cool. Um, okay, okay. How do I get out of here? Hey, there's real science out there. Can I just go out here and get it? Oh, I can. Oh, what? Okay, craft the clover hood, kill that. Yeah, okay, there's my missions. Uh, should I be saving this before I go outside? Oh, well, there's only a hundred, but better than nothing. Alright, maybe I should save it. Let's just save the game now that I'm not in mission anywhere. Uh, how do I get back out again? This is a bit confusing. ASL. Hey, there's lots of crude rope here. Maybe I can take them. They don't seem to mind. Oh, hang on. I've got granola bars. What's a granola bar? Oh, it's food. Oh, okay. I just picked up some snacks. He doesn't seem to mind. Alright, food's getting down a little bit. I've got some roasted like a fruit pounder. meat there. I really need a... really need like a water bottle to take with me. Which... which way did I come in? Was it in here? Where am I going? Hang on, I don't think I did that before. Uh, I didn't come in here before. <laughs> this is like battery, nine volt batteries. Oh crap! There's five hundred. That was pretty good. Where's this take you? Nowhere. Ooh. This morning I installed the borrowed lab modules. Another one of my forgotten inventions from the early days. I had such grand notions back then. Mm. The Kinder Science Mini Quick Little Chemist Lab Educational Toy for Children. Yeah. But no, Wendell, we can't possibly put hydrochloric acid into the hands of children. The lawyers will never agree. <laughs> oh, this is where I came <laughs> It's a good thing I never told them about the Bunsen burners. <laughs> 
odd that Ominent has been using my toy pieces in this way. Hmm. I digress. The lab network is now up and running in the backyard. I'm planning to dedicate each one of them to a different function. Main power will run through here, the Oak Lab is the center of operations for the backyard. The second lab is nestled into the hedge. Such wonderful views from up there. Oh crap, is it night time already? I'm worried that Ominent's shoddy manufacturing of the lab pieces will cause them to fall apart over time, but they will do for now. Oh, it is too. Okay. Hang on a second, can I craft a lean-to here? Where is it? It's there. <laughs> no, not without the three. Don't think my go-to spider elimination strategy is going to be much use on that. Holy crap, what was that? You're going to have a look around. Uh, that wasn't a small spider. By the way, holy jelly! I'm I'm actually <laughs> it's it's just going like really late at night. Holy crap! Um, well, this is going to be interesting. I don't. Oh, apart from the water, I'm okay. Apart from water. Uh, so, if I go to make a lean-to, I just need the sprigs and the clover leaf, but I need to build it somewhere safe, is that right? Nope. Let's have a look. Save. Man, oh man. Steps. Crap, it's coming closer. Holy crap. Uh, that was big, whatever that was. That was similar to the spider I slurred at the door. I don't think it had yellow on its butt though. Um, yeah, this is not good. Can I? He's thirsty. Oh no, I'm gonna have to go out and get some. Well, I saved it. I need some clover. <laughs> Without making too much noise. Don't worry, I'm just quietly moving amongst the clover bushes. <laughs> Jeez. Doesn't feel very safe. Oh dear. The armed raspberry puncher. Hey little aphid dude, come here. <laughs> you could be food for me. Mm -hmm. Crap. Those noises don't sound good, do they? The heck is that sound? <laughs> Jeez! Hey, 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 there's some liquid here. No one's gonna bite my head off. I'm taking the liquid. Uh, oh, crap. Hang on, what's that? I see you. Oh, man, that's the, <laughs> that's the wall spider. Uh, come here, dude. Got a present for you. I need to hop out of here. Is this about the safest place I've got? Oh, crap. I can build my lean-to, at least I'll sleep through the night. Is this going to be safe here though? I uh, haven't got much choice, have I? I'm going to build in this trip. <laughs> Jeez. There you go, fantastic. Fill that up. Oh, she's a beaut. Can I go to sleep now? Yep. Uh, hopefully I'm intact in the morning. And Oh, it's 8 o'clock. Uh, I'm alive. I'm hungry and I'm thirsty, but I'm alive. 
Holy crap. Alright. Well, I didn't think going to the lab was going to take that blinking long. Um, I don't like this location for a base. I mean, it's good because it's flat. I'd rather be up on the ledges or the timber poles or something. Hmm. Lucky there's drink there. I need to make... Actually, maybe I should try making it on one of those timber poles. That... One of them's got to be safer. Hey, little aphid dude. Can I outrun him? Not really, but I got him anyway. Hey, I got some food. I just need to cook it up. Uh, hang on. There's grass over here. There's grass. There's definitely these guys. Did that come out of there? Okay, so hang on. There's water comes out of that juice bottle. Water or juice of some sort must come out of that one. So there's water around. There's little aphids and this is close to where the um, acorns were. Oh, hang on. Can I just jump? Can I just jump up on here? The coast is clear. Well, not really. Okay, well there's plenty of dried grass. Actually, there's clover there, there's normal grass. This is probably not a bad location to build a base. Can I jump up here? No. Uh, what can I build? Craft something in terms of a construction thing? Clover roof. Uh, hang on, stairs. Stairs. How high up can the stairs go? Oh, hang on. Turn that around. Is that as high up as I can go? I want to go up as high as I can. If I can build this... Hang on. Hang on, hang on, what was that? It was four grass planks and a weed stem. one over there. Grass. Let's get some grass first. Uh, ooh. I need to feed myself fairly soon, but I want to build it up on the top there somewhere. Alright, I don't see any danger immediately. <laughs> cool. Oh, jeez. Scared the heck out of myself, it's just the grass falling down. <laughs> I thought there was something walking behind me. Uh, okay, we've got four. There's some more chewy stuff. I want to get up and away from everything. Up here sounds like it's... It must be me making that noise. Okay, one weed stem. Let's see if we can find a weed stem over here. Somewhere... Oh, there's one. There's one just there. Hello! There's one just here. This is a dandelion, isn't it? Yep. Alright. Oh. Oh, crap! Taking my weed, st <laughs> weed stem and I'm out of here. That's a stink bug. I'm sure it is. I'm out of here. Or a bombardier beetle or something. Can I jump up? Oh man! Oh crap. Spider down there. Having a little peek. Spotted you. An orb weaver junior. Right, where was this other guy I was just looking at? Can I see through there? I don't think I can. That to me looked like some sort of beetle. Anyway. Wow, well, cool. Look, I'm up high now. I don't think they can. Oh, spiders might. 
This is the best I've got. I'm close to the lab, I can research stuff. Yeah, I'm, I'm building here. <laughs> Stop it. Um, how are we doing this, Trev? I don't know. Um, well now we can build, we can build, uh, floors. It's only four grass planks. So, which way should we go? Line it up, because I reckon we can build across here. I reckon we can build kind of across that way. So maybe we should just, um... Where should I start, though? This stuff's pretty strong. You can just build over the edge, I suppose. Two, three... There you go. Uh, one, two, three... One, two, three. Actually, I can probably go over the edge a bit. There you go. There's at least three by four. What's making that sound? Oh man, that's scary, whatever the heck that was. That, that didn't sound good. Oh well. What the heck is making that sound? Now I'll grab this watery stuff while I can, the soda drop. Oh jeez, that didn't do much. Is there any more in there? Empty. Oh. Yeah. I'm in a can. <laughs> and it's pretty grand. I Yeah. I, I don't know something about the soda. Uh, uh, shake it, shake it up, and it'll explode ya. Well, well, he's not very good at that, is he? Alright, I need more grass to fill in. Holy dilly. Alright. Let's see if we can start something going. Ooh. Holy crap. Oh. Oh, that's just a lady beetle. Alright, I'm full already. Damn it. Alright. Let's see if I can build a platform and put a cooking thing on it, at least. That would be good. Okay, so... I'm going to... Where would I have it anyway? Would it be over this side, maybe? Uh, hang on, where can I... Um, why can't I... What the heck? Can't I just... Hang on. What the heck is making that noise? Oh, hang on. What the? Oh, you gotta start in the middle, maybe? That was a bit weird. I don't like the sound of that noise. <laughs> Whatever the crap that noise was. That didn't sound good. Excuse me, I just sneezed a bit off camera there. <laughs> I think I need another lung. Something down there before was moving. Hmm. Don't like the feeling of that. Um, um, um. Hang on. Should be able to cut down a bit more grass than that, Trev. Alright, well I might have to build this really quickly and then end the episode, I'm sorry to say. Uh, what I might do, ah oh man, it's full already, see if I can get something started in terms of cooking, because I at least need to have a lean-to up here and a cooking thing. Like I did at the, on top of the, what the crap? <laughs> on the top of the baseball. Jeez, that was falling off. That's better. Okay. Alright, people. I am up here. Um, I'm going to have to leave the episode here. It's going to go too long. But, at least, I think this is going to be a decent sized base here. And this is right near this lab. I can still go back to the baseball, I guess. But anyway, I might do a little bit of building off camera to get this started. 
Um, but yeah, at least we've started the quests. Um, we have to make a clover hood, the gnats, and make a gas mask. Hmm, okay, there's a few things to do. Alright, I'll have to leave the episode here. If you've liked what you've seen today, smash the like button to help and support the channel. If you want to help the channel even more, please subscribe. That way you also get notified of more videos as they pop up on the channel. Alright, thanks everyone. Cheers.